In our morning round, stopping a summertime killer, drowning is the leading cause of accidental death among kids four and younger, and the second leading cause for children under the age of 15. But Michelle Miller shows us how new life-saving technology could make the difference in the pool or at the beach. She's in Cambridge, Massachusetts. Michelle, good morning. Good morning. Well, it's a horrifying statistic. The Center for Disease Control and Prevention reports that some 800 children die from drowning in rivers, lakes, pools, and beaches every single year. So one father turned to technology in hopes of reducing that risk. While water should be a source of summer fun, it is sadly often the site of tragedy, taking as little as 20 seconds for a child to drown. You don't want to think that on your watch that something could happen to your child. You used to be a lifeguard? Yes. Gina Cristitiello took her eyes off her three-year-old daughter at the family pool just long enough for her to slip underwater. I just happened to look over at the time, and my sister-in-law was pulling her up, thank God. And it was the most scariest thing in my life. Not sit there and watch the pool the entire time. Dave Cutler uh, saw just how quickly a child uh, can disappear from sight her, when a nine-year-old uh, boy nearly point drowned point in their point neighborhood point lake, point suffering point neurological point damage. Drowning is just very, very difficult to detect. It's not like what you see in Hollywood. It's, it's quiet, it happens fast, and the child could look like they're swimming underwater or playing. In response, Cutler created the eye swim band, the first wearable device to detect potential drownings. It is worn as a headband by swimmers or wristband by anyone who should not be in the water. The sensor detects when it's been submerged too long and sounds an alarm on your smartphone or iPad. What is the warning time? Uh, well, for non-swimmers, it's almost instantaneous. It's three seconds. The headband is 20 seconds of straight submersion. You could also, I mean, an adult could use this in certain circumstances. Absolutely, or, or people with disabilities, elderly. So how will you judge the success of this product? When it becomes commonplace, where it's no different than wearing a seatbelt, wearing a bike helmet, and it's not something new, but something typical of, of swimming. Cutler hopes this new technology will serve as another level of protection, but warns it should not be used as a replacement for vigilant supervision. We hope our product will save lives, but the only true thing that can save a life is another person retrieving that victim from the water. And the eye swim band has an effective range of about 100 feet at a cost of $99. Gail? Small price to pay. I love this idea. Thank you, Michelle. That's a good it's use such of technology. A scary thing. Yes, yeah. I think so too. Yeah. And that loud bomb, bomb gets your attention. Yeah. And a reminder to everybody any birthday parties, hire a lifeguard if That's you're right. doing a pool party. Well worth the money. Very good advice.